Hello everybody, this is Shaheen. Welcome to Shaheen's Kitchen. Today on my husband's demand, I am making fish kebab. And I want to share this recipe with you all. It is very simple and turns out awesome. So have a look how to make this awesome recipe. See, this is a boiled fish which I have boiled and there were some bones in it so I have kept it in the fridge. When it has got hard I have separated. If you get uh, boneless fish that's okay, fine. And if you cannot uh, get the boneless fish, do the same procedure. These are 4 to 5 pieces and I have boiled it. I am telling you in a small quantity because it is for the beginners and this is gram flour or basin which I have dry roasted on in a pan these are 2 to 3 teaspoon of it coriander 1 teaspoon of ginger garlic paste we are preparing fish kebabs Put green chilies according to your taste. If they are very hot, then just adjust the quantity. Same way, take red chilli powder according to your taste. Garam masala powder. Once again, salt according to your taste. This is lemon juice of half a lemon and mix all these things well. Add onion, see it is a personal choice whether we want to deep fry them or shallow fry them. And here we have diluted corn flour, 4 teaspoon of corn flour powder diluted with water. And now start preparing your kebabs in any shape which you like. Just roll them once and again we will roll them with the corn flour and bread crumbs. Shape them like this. Roll them dry, just press them little and prepare all your kebabs like this. Then we will roll them twice with the bread crumbs. The oil should be hot and now dip in the corn flour, pat them nicely with the crumb. And if you are doing it for the first time, don't put too many kebabs at the same time. Just put 3-4 so that you can handle them nicely.
see once they are done from the side turn them carefully can you see the beautiful color the golden brown color they are crunchy and you can use the soil after frying run through a sieve and you can easily store this oil in the freezer so that once again you can use it whenever you want to fry your things they are getting done on medium flame just a minute for the new ones the old ones are ready so i am taking them out on a tissue paper so that extra oil will be absorbed by them just drain the extra oil like this i hope you all will like the recipe not very difficult the only thing is the fish if you have a boneless fish it's very easy and if you have a fish with bones little pain you'll have to take can you see all our kebabs are ready now just put another tissue paper on top so that they'll absorb all the oil the extra oil like this Enjoy them with green chutney and tomato ketchup.